All right, so this video is going to be about working out in the morning. So it is basically, I don't know, it almost feels right to start your day in the morning working out, but in a way you would rather choose other tasks. So for me, my opportunity cost in economic terms is reading. I always, I always start my day with what I like to and I have done for the past year. Start my day with uh, with a book that I try to finish per week, or like this book. This is a big book, so it might take me like three weeks or even a month. So, and I get like an hour done of reading. That that's usually how I like to spend my day. And in the past, I would wake up, read for 45 minutes, and then. 6 a.m. in the morning, so I'll go to the gym with my buddy and then I'll spend one hour and a half or two hours at the gym. Most of the time is wasted on me and him taking turns. And now he, uh, more of our buddies came. So now there's like three or four people at the gym and we all work out together. And now I'm in this conundrum of whether I want to go work out alone or work out with them. So that was sort of confusing in a way. And then it was just taking way too much time in the morning. So I thought I could, I usually like to get some schoolwork done before school starts. So I've kind of changed that uh, routine now. So now what I do is I wake up at 4.10 and I read and then, and then I, uh, and I do my schoolwork for about two hours and at 7, 7 a.m. in the morning, I go take a run, jog, and then come back. So that's sort of the morning routine that I have right now that I'll probably stick to for a while. Who knows what will happen in the future, but I'm liking this process more. I run now, so that's a lot of cardio and that might reduce my gains in a way, but I'm trying to figure out another uh, routine of trying to shove in some gain, uh, some workouts at the gym, lifting weights. So in, in, the, in the week, what I've sort of done now is on Monday, Wednesday, and Friday, I wait, I go and run at 7 a.m. And then, which takes me about 30 minutes. And then on Tuesday, Thursday, and Saturday, I I lift at the gym. So that's three workouts at the gym. And I don't lift in the morning. I actually lift in the afternoon around 5 p.m. So that is sort of what's productive for me right now. <clears throat> you hear people saying workout or lifting in the morning is good. I think it's, uh, it is good definitely if you aren't usually working out or if you feel exhausted in the afternoon. But for most students, if you want to get some school work done before school starts, I think it's more productive to work out in the afternoon because you feel like you have accomplished something by doing your school work before school starts. And especially for me, I have this habit of trying to read early in the morning because I know that I won't read in the afternoon or late night because it's just not the way my brain functions. It's not the way I just don't have time for it. And I'm even trying to shove in some guitar practices too. So I usually do that on the weekends whenever I feel like it. So that's sort of the problem right now. And again, that's sort of the process that I'm working out with. So if if I, yes, this is why I stopped working out in the morning because I just don't really find time. Hopefully you learn something if you're trying to change your routine or if you're trying to maybe shove in that early morning workout time block into another time then this is probably somewhat inspirational video for you because maybe you're just trying to find another way to convince yourself that you would that you want to work out in a different time but you just can't because you're so consumed and you're so obsessed with trying to do some exercise on a daily basis and you thought that in the morning is probably the best but you feel worse after you work out in a way like you have that regret feeling if you don't have the regret feeling then it's probably not a good thing 
and that's why I do it in the afternoon now. Hope you learned something from this video. Definitely subscribe and see you guys next time.